Four people, meantime, are dead. Several others injured after a nearly naked man opened fire at a Waffle House restaurant near Nashville, Tennessee. The suspect police are looking for at this hour was once detained by Secret Service at the White House. CBS News correspondent Laura Podesta tells us more about the hunt for the shooter. Police are combing the suburbs of Nashville looking for Travis Ryan King. The 29 year old is suspected of shooting six people, killing four of them at this Waffle House restaurant in Antioch, Tennessee, early Sunday morning. This lunatic in a pickup pulled up. Um, he got out with an assault rifle, wearing only a jacket, nothing from the waist down. It really just craziness. And uh, he shot a, a customer who was about to go in the door. And then he shot my friend who was trying to get away on the sidewalk. Police say Ryan King then went inside the Waffle House and continued shooting. During a pause in the gunfire, this man, James Shaw Jr., charged the suspect and grabbed the AR-15 rifle. He started kind of wrestling for it and scuffling and fighting for it. And um, after he, he let it go with one hand and then when he just had, had it in his other hand, I just took it and I tossed it over the, um, the counter. Police say Ryan King ran from the Waffle House, possibly stopping at his apartment to put on pants. Police surrounded his home but did not find him inside. Ryan King was known to law enforcement. The Secret Service said he was arrested last July in D.C. after crossing a barrier near the White House. Officials say four guns were taken from Ryan King during that investigation. They were later returned to his father, who gave them back to his son. Police confirmed two of the guns are unaccounted for, and the 29-year-old could still be armed. Laura Podesta for CBS3 Eyewitness News.